personal and to you know be a leader out there on the offense. Um, you know, sometimes we can get down okay, and bubble it. Okay, it's Dowser, right? Yes, sir. Okay, I'm sure about that. that. I give up correcting <laughs> people on <laughs> time. <laughs> yeah, I probably get told. Okay, so uh, midnight madness. Tell me uh, your feelings about that. Um, I'm ready for ready to get started. I mean, no one really likes the conditioning test, but you know it's the start of the season, and once we get it out of the way, we're in pads and we're practicing and getting ready for the game, so we're ready to go. How weird is it? Yeah, football It's definitely different, but I think you know most of us are up at midnight anyway, so. I think it, it shouldn't be too different for a bunch of the guys. <laughs> Even during the season, you're up one day? Some of them, yeah. Uh, but, but that's not normally what you're doing at one day. No, no, sir. <laughs> so, uh, how, how good does it feel just to, just to be back? Uh, you know, the season's just three days away. It's great. I mean, we, it's, it's felt like an extremely long off season. You know, uh, I think for me, it's it's good to have kind of a and you know, like I feel more in place than I did last year, not being a new kid anymore. And uh, you know, I think that's been part of why I haven't gone through a transition from school to school this year. And so I think that's maybe why it's felt a little drawn out. But I think we're all ready to go and excited to get, get the season started. You know, uh, a lot of people have said one of the keys to the program this year is the fact that you're back to you offer the stability that they haven't had before. They've never had it. Quarterback in the system as long as you can. Do you feel comfortable now with this being the second year? I do. I, I feel like I've had a great offseason, a good spring, and really uh, become more comfortable in the off, in the offense and as a leader here. And I do think that that definitely plays into how much success we have this year. I think that that definitely adds another dimension to what we're going to be able to do. So you got a great fan base of Pueblo. I probably figured that out last year. They're expecting some big things from you, though, this year. Is that, is that a good thing? Or a little pressure, maybe? Well, we're expecting big things from ourselves. So I think I think we're our, we're our worst critics. You know, we put we have bigger goals or set our goals for ourselves higher than or just as high as our fans do. So I think you know I think we're right on par with what everyone else is expecting. But I mean. Like Jamal had said, we don't want to be unrealistic with some of our goals, and we want to take it week to week and then just handle our business week to week and not get ahead of ourselves. So your opener against West Texas a and I would like to uh, so schools open against kind of weak teams uh, down the one and over record. This is no weak team. Well, we have, we've kind of had to do that in the past. We haven't been in a position to challenge a team like West Texas. And uh, I think, like Coach Riston has said, and kind of our thinking is that we've earned it. This is where we want to be. We want to be playing big games and playing guys that, and teams that, have, that are very well respected and have rec good track records. And so we can prove that you know, to everyone else, we know that we're good enough and we want to prove that. You got a minute, man? You got that Colorado Mines game. Once you face the scenes, we're going to face it. Obviously, that's kind of nice. Plus, I think you guys know you will come out to get up here and visit a semi. Is that possible? I guess you could say that. But you know, they're a great team every yeah. year. And regardless of what happened last year or the year before, or, you know, our past relationship, I think it's going to be a great game because they're always ready to play. So, I ask, I'm not sure if I asked Jamal about this, but I ask uh, Grant about this uh, attitude. Is there a different attitude maybe this year when you walked in today than, say, last year? Um, I think so. Uh, we're an older team. We've got some very good experience, some solid experience coming back in. I think there is a lot of confidence. It kind of was, we're not so much the underdogs that we've been in the past. I think we still are to many people, but not as much as we used to be. And so I think there is definitely a little bit more confidence going into the season. Cool. Thank you. Very good. All right. Thanks,